how to fix invalid parameter error in Instagram. Hey guys, welcome back to 1 million ideas YouTube channel. In this video, I'll tell you how to fix this problem in your Instagram app. So guys, before proceeding further, make sure to subscribe our YouTube channel and then hit that bell icon so that you receive all our latest updates. So guys, uh, this problem is one of the very most common problem that we face on Instagram. So I'll tell you the exact solution how you can fix this problem in your Instagram app. So guys, uh, I'll tell you uh, 3 to 4 ways to fix this problem. So stay with me till the end so that you will get to be fixed with your problem. So guys, uh, what happened is uh, the very first thing you have to do is you have to go to your uh, Play Store account. Play Store and then here you have to search Instagram and then check whether the update is available or not. If the available uh, is the update is available, then you have to update the application. What happened is sometimes what happened Instagram update their uh, applications with latest security and the features. So what happened if we do not update it? Then what happened is the applications itself start uh, misbehaving. Okay, and then the, many of the errors start occurring on our Instagram account. So you better first uh, update your Instagram app and then go back to your Instagram and then check what you were doing and uh, when your problem was appearing. Go whatever you were doing and do it and check if the, uh, if the problem is solved or not. If the problem is still appearing, then I'll tell you the second step what you have to do is go to your mobile settings. And then here you have to scroll down, scroll up, and then you have to go to manage apps. Or you may find installed apps or application management on some devices, okay? From here you have to search Instagram app. And if the search option is not on your mobile, then just scroll up and then search for the Instagram. Now here you have to click on the Instagram and go to storage usage. And from here you have to clear data. Now remember that after clearing the data you will be logged out from your instagram but it is not going to delete the instagram data okay it is only going to be logged out from your application so click on the clear data and then click on the ok and then go back and then go back to permission and then here you have to allow all the permissions if the permission itself is already enabled then disable all the permissions and then re-enable all the permissions now what happened is permission will get restart okay now what happened is go to data usage one and then you have to allow mobile data wi-fi and background data okay now allowing this after uh, doing this restart your phone and then reopen your instagram app and whatever you were doing earlier you just do it and then check the whether the problem is fixed or not if it is fixed that's great but if it is still appearing then the third solution is the third solution is go to play store and then uninstall your application and then reinstall the app and then check out whether it whether the problem is fixed or not but if it is still appearing if the problem is still appearing then the last thing the fourth step is go to your about phone and then go to system update and from here if the system is asking you for the update then you have to update it now what happened is listen to very carefully now what i'm going to say now what happened is uh, now what happened is uh, instagram instagram team usually update their uh, applications weekly or monthly okay now what happened if you have updated your instagram in latest version but you are not using the latest versions of Android software in your mobile then what happened is Instagram they have they have you know they have updated their app so that their app will be compatible with the latest Android version so guys if you do not update your system then what happened is your uh, application Instagram applications will not be suitable will not be compatible with your mobile so that's why you have to update this software update um, after updating this software system updating uh, your system uh, you will uh, see your all the problems uh, has already resolved okay so guys uh, this is how you can fix your problem i believe this video definitely helps you if this video helps you give one thumbs up thanks for watching